Hello guys, welcome back to the next Spidey Max um, tutorial. This uh, video was suggested by Jamal Uganami um, regarding how to get Spider-Man Edge of Time running on RPC S3. So let's do it. All right. So once you guys already have it downloaded, I'm gonna leave the link in the download description. You're gonna unzip it. Once you already unzipped it from the site, it should look like this. You then want to copy. You then want to go over to um, RPCS3. Should load it up. Now, I already have it installed, but just in case, let's say for sake of argument, I didn't have it installed. So, you want to go over to Add Games. Now, I would recommend you actually have a, a folder for, for, for all your games on linked and everything going on RPC S3. So I actually made a folder. It's on my desktop. It's under big games. PS3. You, can, you click PS3. You then would drop the game in, in there. Like I already dropped the game. So I don't really need to do it. But I'll just do it just sake of argument. Uh, yeah, replace. So. Do, 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 do. And boom. All right, so the game is installed. Just want to refresh. All right, Spider-Man Edge of Time. And you want to click it. Good good. Okay. All right, so now it's loading up. I'll go over the settings once it's all done loaded. So I just want to get you guys to see if that actually does work. All right. Spider-Man Edge of Time is working. Activision logo, Beanox logo, no Marvel logo. Ah, Beanox. Configurations, I think it's under, no, emulation, yeah, I think it's under configuration. Configurations, file containers, entry, system, no, I don't want to do that. So my GPU is Vulkan, NVIDIA GeForce, aspect 16 by 9. I just like to leave mine at 60, um, into aliasing. Yeah, I think I can make this bigger, can I? No. The, like like everything I just leave at default. I did um bump up the the um what do you call it? The resolution. Resolution scale I just keep it the same thing. What if I do this? No, this is not I don't wanna mess with this. I don't know what this is. Alright, so I'll, I'll, I'll let you guys copy it down, I guess. All right, make CPU. Like everything for RPC Studio, like I, I just leave it at default, and honestly. Like I don't mess with the, it, if the game's not causing me issues. So yeah. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a nice day. If you guys have any questions, Regarding how to set up any other future Spider-Man games, uh, just comment down below. Bye.